Good evening everyone, it's SBG Active Aussie here. I'm just going for a brief night walk and it's a lot more comfortable this time of night. It's about 6.30 p.m. I was just thinking recently about my life now compared to my life about 20 years ago when I was in my normie blue pill days, if you want to call it that. And this time, 20 years ago, in March 2003, I was married. I was working five to six days a week. Sometimes I was working six days a week. And my life was very, very different. I was thinking about the sort of things I used to do on the weekend or on a Saturday night. And when I was married to the Thai girl, sometimes on a Saturday night, we would go to the cinema. She was into the cinema, I liked to go and watch movies out at Carindale. So some of you guys familiar with Brisbane would remember, I think they had a Birch Carol and Coyle multiplex out there. It's still there, but it's under a different name. So they had eight cinemas out there. So I'd go there on a Saturday night or otherwise I'd just be at home watching TV and my wife would be cooking Thai or Chinese food. My ex-wife is Thai. So what was your life like back when you were married or you were in a serious relationship, when you were a normie, and do you ever think about it much? I have a few regrets, I suppose. Everyone does, a few regrets about what I've done in life and what I could have done and should have done, whatever. But that's just normal, and it's water under the bridge and you just move on. But um, sometimes I reminisce and think about the past, but not really that often. I've pretty much moved on with my life in regard to my divorce long ago. I'm just here at the entrance to, the main entrance to Tui Forest, the most popular place. So there's a, quite a large car park here and many people park their cars. And um, I don't usually come here at night time, but um, it's much cooler now and it's um, very beautiful to walk around. You've still got cyclists who come through from Griffith University, but you've got to have a light on your bike, obviously, because it gets very dark. But just down here toward Tui Road, it's all lit up, so it's pretty well lit around here. I'm going to be a bad boy tonight. I'm going to go and get some junk food, go up to Ipswich Road at Annerley, not far from my apartment. But um, I usually cook at night time, but in the morning I'll go to the cafe and sometimes cook in the morning, but not that often. I usually eat out, but try to eat some healthy food in the morning. But um, I'm going to eat junk food food tonight is just a treat because I'm feeling a bit lazy, don't feel like cooking at all. Just got a plane going overhead, it's right on the flight path here and I think um, some of the planes use Tui Mountain as a navigation aid when they're coming into land at Brisbane Airport so you get a bit of aircraft noise here sometimes but um, it's, it's always beautiful and I'm just looking down toward Tui Road there now but um, quite nice to make a video this time of night anyway like I said I just, just want to know your feelings and opinions about your blue pill days when you were a normie so to speak I'd be quite curious to know about that as um, MGTOW and red pill guys our lives change quite a lot I was still blue pilled and in a normie phase when I was living in China and Thailand for a while too. I'd say I've only really been a MGTOW since about 2017. Although before then I was um, I was living a type of MGTOW lifestyle, semi-MGTOW lifestyle before that. I was still dating a little bit in 2016, but not very often. Certainly didn't have a girlfriend in um, 2016. I was done with full-time permanent relationships by then. The last really serious girlfriend I had was back in mid-2015, a Chinese lady. And that's long over now. Anyway, just having a few thoughts about different things. And um, that's all for now. I'll talk to you later.